I think the concept of design for a lot of people is, it that, is that it's kind of the icing on the cake. And what we're about here is showing that it's actually not the icing on the cake, it's the cake itself. It's taking the problems and finding solutions. And that's what designers are trained to do. And so looking at what we're doing here now, these are really practical things that will be taken on board and actually change our world. I don't have thoughts and feelings like humans do, but I'm happy when my designs are thought-provoking, helping the viewer question the role of new technologies in our lives. The failed utility of these objects symbolizes the ways that AI has the potential to become problematic. And I hope my work results in discussion around these topics. So why would you have designs that fail at the design biennale? Doesn't seem right. Well, that's because we're actually using it as a critique and a question of where the whole AI world is going. It promises so much. It does incredible things, as you can see by some of these amazing objects that Ada's created. But are they actually delivering? What's the domino effect of this technology? Where is it leading? До російського вторгнення в Україну український дизайн розвивався разом з світовим дизайном, вписуючи свої локальні меседжі в глобальні дискусії. Але зараз ми стали більш функціональні і більш раціонально використовувати матеріали, які є в нашому можливості використання. From the overall concept, the most important thing why we call inner peace in this world, crisis happens every time, wars. After COVID, after pandemic, all the humanity need is a purification as a metaphor, as a waterfall.
I think in Design Biennale, you've got a lot of designs that are very sort of out there in terms of quite futuristic and quite um, visually appealing, but that does trickle down into everyday design and decisions we make about the things we buy and the things we live with. So I think there is a relationship between this and what we would have in our day-to-day -day life, much like there is between, a, say, a fashion catwalk and what we buy in shops.